Well, hello, my lovely friends. Welcome to the last few video of the year, nay, the decade. I certainly hope you've had a lovely time in 2019. It's been a bit weird, isn't it? But yes, for one last time in the 2010s, we're going to dive back into the P.O. box. Oh, we've got some big ones this time. Thank you for the packages, but that's enough. I'm literally buried in Transformer stuff. All right, I reckon let's arbitrarily do this one first. Why not? This is a big-ish, but not mega heavy one that's come all the way from the Australias. Can't tell who it's from yet. It's rubbed off, but there's a letter in here. There's a little, like, blister thing with a letter in it. But let's do that first. Hey, Thew. Hey. I've been watching your channel for a few months now, and I'm very much a fan. I enjoy the energy and eloquence you display for your love of Transformers. It's all a facade. Please see inside some relics from my own collection, which I feel will do you some good to your own. From the land down under, I wish you well, Andrew. Well, thank you, my opposite hemisphere chum. God, I feel I should restate that it's not lost on me how fabulous it is that people just give me stuff out of their own collection. I know I'll probably say this more than I realise, but it still doesn't feel like I say it enough that I'm truly blessed and deeply grateful for all the support that everyone gives me, be it a box or a Patreon or just watching. It's all good and I love you and I'm not worthy. Okay, what do we have then? We have a carrier bag, a lot of Australian air, cool, imported gas goods. Whoa. Oh, mate, no way. Flipping G1 Sandstorm. I actually legitimately don't know how this works. God, how many blades, mate? Flipping heck. So we have a certain Generation 1 Triple Changer Sandstorm being a, a kind of sad little helicopter. Not the most buoyant of boys, is he? I've got missiles. Where do they go? This is actually a real treat, man. That, uh, most of the uh, G1 Autobot Triple Changers pass me by. But I've got Broadside. And he's famously rubbish. But Springer and, and Sandstorm have always passed me by entirely. <laughs> he's kind of, a, kind of a doofbag, isn't he? There's something special about the G1 detail stickers. They're so great. I kind of like them more when they're a bit worn out. Are these his? Dunno, but that's wonderful, isn't it? Bit of G1 doof to kick us off. <laughs> and we have a, uh, a G2, I want to say Scram or one of that lot. Windbreaker. Oh, he's in great shape. His motor becomes a gun. With a, with a motor on it. <laughs> Come on. Now, this is a lad I always see at uh, conventions and stuff. They've, there's always seven or eight of him knocking around. Not totally sure who he is. Confirmed for not Scram. It's not Rapida. Oh, there he is. Cliff jumpery face and uh, hot pink light piping. Yeah, Windbreaker. God, imagine being called Windbreaker. It's like you're either named after a horrible coat or just anal gas. Let's uh, luxuriate in his rectal aroma. Yeah, thank you, Andrew. Love a bit of G2. Uh, we have a certain monkey man. Yes, mate. This is uh, the original Mega Class Optimus Primal, I believe. Is it Mega? God, he's brilliant, this one. I love him a lot. This freaky Megadeth mask, which reveals an actually really good Optimus Prime head. So I'm thinking if this has all its gear, two missiles in the back, you should have a mace, I think, inside his arm. Oh. <laughs> wrong arm, wrong gimmick. Yes, he's got another uh, heavy metal mascot and a hook. <laughs> I love this thing, it's all gimmicks. More missiles and a couple of swords. Well, we are complete, complete Optimus Primal. So, what do you think about a giveaway? <laughs> If anybody out there would enjoy a complete, very good condition Optimus Primal, courtesy of our Andrew in Australia, please do send an email to thewgiveaways at gmail.com with just the word monkey. Just monkey, nothing else. Don't try and persuade me. Don't try and be extra funny or referential or try and garner my good favour. Just the word monkey, nothing else. He could be yours. Oh, Andrew, thank you. Andrew. <laughs> Terrible. And we have two other big lads. Uh, this is a G2. I want to say... Dirt bag? Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that T-form on his grill there, you see that? It looks like Tonka, but it says T-form. Tiny little squished up workman head there with a bit of a orange light pipe. He's got like a hat hard on. <clears throat> I mean, a hat hard on. I've said it again. Pretty sure that's dirt bag, right? Ugh, there he goes, flopping back down. And we have his mate as well. <laughs> I want to say landmine. Looks a lot like, um, looks a lot like grindcore. Is this his? Yes, this is his, right. Spinning disc weapon. God, this guy's a monster. Yeah. Yeah, kind of a landminey flavor. Sergeant Hound, that sort of bit. What's his name? He looks a lot like Grindcore. Roadblock, that's the boy. Yes, we found him live on camera. Flipping G2 Roadblock. 
saying the rhyme ain't a crime. If I can say it to you, it must be true. Well, thank you so much, Andrew. What a great little set. Friggin' Roadblock and Dirtbag, Windbreaker, Sandstorm, and Optimus Primal, no less. All in wonderful shape and feeling fine. Moving on. We have a, uh, 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 it is a parcel, which has got my address on it and something inside, I assume. <laughs> Don't even need the thing. <laughs> Marvel at my might. Yes, can confirm my suspicions. This is indeed a parcel with a thing in it. But whatever could be the nature of said thing? Welcome to the show. Well, it's a letter. That's what it says. <laughs> I recently found your channel and have had a ton, an imperial ton of fun watching your reviews. Nice one. It's nice to see a Transformers fan that actually seems to enjoy the hobby. Urgh, Hasbro. Why is everything your fault? I wanted to send you some figures that are cool, but I don't have too much space for because I have a baby on the way. Oh, from Charlie. Oh, nice one. P.S. I don't know if you own any of these. I haven't had the chance to get through your whole backlog. Me neither. Ah, oh, brilliant. Thank you, Charlie. So let's see where we're at. Uh, we have an exploding car backdrop. This is Studio Series, clearly. Number two. Who that? Oh, we have a boxed full Starscream. Studio Series number six. Oh, baby. Yeah, yeah, I have got one. <laughs> <laughs> few giveaways, just put Starscream and uh, you might get one. Whee! And also we have Studio Series Stinger, looks like. That's a handsome sports car. That looks a lot like uh, Knockout, doesn't he? Oh, flipping heck. Oh God, I don't know if I've got the patience to sit here and figure out a movie toy right now on camera. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, that's marvellous. I didn't have this one. I did actually kind of want to check this out, but I couldn't find it anywhere. Like it was everywhere for a bit. And then when I thought, oh, I might go and get one of them, they were just gone. So yes, young Stinger is most welcome. Oh yes, that's right. This is the scene where um, 200 of these just get shot in the head by Hound, don't they? And there was that brilliant bit with the massive grenade. It's funny, wasn't it? Those movies don't know what humour is. There's something fun about these backdrops. I had a bit of a purge on the old packaging recently. I got rid of all my, like, Power of the Primes boxes and all the Studio Series boxes, but I kept all the backdrops, because I do like them in a way, and also they stack. It's a good story, isn't it? Who cares? Oh, we did it. Okay. <laughs> right, last up then, oh, we have... A colossal package, which has arrived all the way from China. God, it's gigantic. There better not be any people in here. How else are we going to end the year other than with the biggest friggin' box you've ever seen in your life? Like, is this a New Year special or what? Futon Nanny! I have my suspicions as to who this is from. No idea what the hell could be in here. Alright, I'm gonna have to, uh... I'm gonna have to floor this one. Don't let anyone tell you that YouTube isn't work, alright? I mean, it's always work doing, you know, videos and editing and that, but... It's very rare that it's actually, like, manual labour. <laughs> Need some backup on this one. Oh my god. There's so much stuff in here. Uh, ooh, uh, oh no, oh what? Oof, woof, woof, woof. Y'all know what time it is. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. You've got to be joking. You have got to be joshing me. Masterpiece. <laughs> what? <laughs> Masterpiece. MP36 plus, MP36 plus. <sighs> Have we peaked? How could this not be the peak? Who has done this? What sort of a bonkers maniac? Happy New Year! <laughs> oh, bitch! Masterpiece, MP36 plus Megatron. Good God, my baby. My baby friend of all God Jesus is. What? I'm just saying words at this point. I don't know what I don't know what else to do. My sweaty stain there from where I bashed my head on it. <sighs> Flipping heck, bro. <laughs> All right, let's find out who the hell has done this thing about. Right, got it. This is from uh, Jake LaBombarb and Anna. I get it now. They sent me this message a bit ago and I didn't fully understand it. But they've sent me a figure that might please a 36-year-old plus a Christmas card. Might please in capitals and then plus, right? MP36 plus, yeah. But I do remember thinking when I read this, how do you know that I'm 36? I do overshare a lot, so I figured it was just that. But it was coded for meaning Megatron. Oh man, so Jake and Anna, what the hell? The absolute angels. And that's not even all, there's more stuff in here. <laughs> all right, a knockoff, oversized, Combiner Wars, Legends class Skywarp, Pocket War Commander. <laughs> Thunter Corker and Scoo Alp. 
That's too good. Ah, designed by Machine Boy Toys. Designed by, robbed by, more like. I see you. Ah, school <laughs> <laughs> Plus, oh, there we are. It was wedged in there. Oh, flipping heck. It's a uh, knockoff leader class combiner was Skywar. Build their own deformation robot. Create a Magmax that belongs to you. Is that a combiner thing? Is Magmax the new Gestalt? Some kind of cool artwork there. I assume that's stolen. Looks a bit Pat Lee era. That doesn't. We have actual written communique. Merry Christmas. Oh my God, look at him. Angry Santa. He is furious. He is the Santagonist. Dear Dr. Thugo Strange, my wife and I are a couple of expats and we love watching your videos, especially Damn It Open. So we thought we'd send some few appropriate gifts in time for Crimbo. Kind of. Please enjoy this selection and thank you for the years of entertainment. Also, stop being so hard on yourself. You're a good egg. Is that a bold joke? Yours truly, Jake and Anna. Oh, thank you. I'm only half serious when I put myself down. I only kind of mean it. Folks, you have spoiled me rotten here. You're still in the process of spoiling me rotten because there's another thing in there. Oh, folks. Why? Whyest? Whyest hast thou? This is insane, man. This is too much. Transformers Golden Lagoon Edition Combiner Wars Starscream. It's bizarre to me that this mold with the Starstream head. They, they never did anything else with it, did they? They did like the ghost version and the silly Golden Lagoon version, but they never just did a normal one. We never got those Seeker limbs we wanted. Do I want to open this? Yeah, yeah. Is this an unboxing show or what? <laughs> Look at that. That is some glisteny garbage. Oof. Oh, this seems cursed. I feel like I'm going to be punished for my hubris. I don't know if it's even coming over on camera because it's so shiny. There we go. You can at least maybe make out some details there. Well, well, well. Yeah, yeah, all right then. <laughs> That is a lot. Golden Lagoon Edition Starscream, which I've never actually seen, ever. Some of the best knockoff nonsense I've seen in years. Not to mention MP36 Plus Masterpiece Megatron. <laughs> that is obscene. I guess living in China has its uh, supply advantages, I would imagine. What are we gonna do to top that? I think we can probably just stop now forever. Oh God, gonna be a good year, I think. So all the best for the new year, 2020, coming at you. Big thanks to Jake and Anna and to Charlie and to Andrew in Australia. So pleased to have a wonderful New Year's night. I'll see you uh, on the other side of the decade gap. Is that what we're calling it? I've got a few more boxes. I'll probably get enough for one more of these and then we'll call it a day on Damn It Open. For now, let's not freak out and we'll push forward with some flipping actual reviews. Imagine that. So my name's Theo, and from me to you, please do have a happy new year. Random bedroom journal. Oh, mate, thank you for watching and thank you for a wonderful year. An extra special patrony thanks to the one called Poobah. And to all a good night. Be sure to subscribe for more Theo's Awesome Transformers reviews. Limited appeal, keeping it real.